Welcome to News Onces, where we bring your neighborhood article to life. With warning for unvaccinated, Biden lays out plan to fight surging Omicron. Washington, December 21st, Reuters, U.S. President Joe Biden announced on Tuesday more federal vaccination and testing sites to tackle a surge in COVID-19 driven by the Omicron variant, and said 500 million free at-home rapid tests will be available to Americans starting in January. Biden offered both a warning to the unvaccinated, who he said have good reason to be concerned, and reassurance that those who are inoculated can gather for the holidays despite the new variant sweeping the country. No this is not March of 2020, Biden. 200 million people are fully vaccinated, we're prepared, we know more. Biden's remarks came as some cities and states imposed new measures aimed at protecting the public, including stricter vaccine mandates. Striking a dire tone about the risks to the one in four American adults who are not fully vaccinated, Biden said they have a significantly higher risk of ending up in the hospital or even dying. Biden noted that former President Donald Trump has also received his booster shot. Maybe one of the few things he and I agree on. The measures laid out on Tuesday include activating new pop-up vaccination clinics run by the Federal Emergency Management Agency and federal testing sites starting this week, including in hotspot New York City. Biden also said that some 1,000 military doctors, nurses and medics have been deployed to support hospitals already being overwhelmed by COVID-19 patients in some areas. Biden's pandemic response has been criticized for focusing on vaccines at the detriment of testing and masking, and for underestimating the impact of the anti-vaccine movement in the United States. Peddling lies and allowing misinformation that can kill their own customers. Biden. The new federal measures will not be fully in place by Christmas, leaving many Americans scrambling to find available tests ahead of holiday gatherings and travel, and confused about whether it is safe to press ahead with their plans. The Omicron variant, which was first detected last month and now accounts for 73% of U.S. cases, is causing infections to double in 1.5 to 3 days, according to the World Health Organization. It is not yet known whether it causes more serious illness than the Delta variant. Read more. If you like this video please subscribe, we post more of what you like. The rapid rise of infections is once again disrupting life, across the country, cancelling events from Broadway shows to professional sports. If I don't, I could take a chance of sending it home to my family, and I'm not trying to do that, Ronald Tives. $100, for a booster in NYC. With new infections spiking, local officials are also taking steps to encourage vaccinations, including boosters, and increase testing and mitigation measures.